In this video, we're going to take a look at the scheduling options that are available for either the TP-Link HS110 or the HS100 smart plug. In order to create a schedule for our smart plug, we need to first open the CASA app. This is a free download available at the app stores for either iOS or Android. As we've already configured our smart plug in a previous video, when we open the CASA app, the smart plug is listed along with the other TP-Link smart devices that we have. For this video, we're using a HS110, so when we select our smart plug from the list, we are shown a summary of the plug's usage, total runtime, and three options. Schedule. Away. And timer. Let's first take a look at Schedule. You'll use Schedule to allow electronically powered devices to automatically turn on and off as needed. A scenario where you would use this option might be in the control of a set of Christmas tree lights that automatically turn on or off at specific times of the day. First, we need to create a new event. This event will set when the smart plug will turn on. From within the event, we need to set the timer for when the smart plug will provide power to the Christmas tree lights. We then need to select which days this event will take place on. For this example, we will be setting this event for every day of the week. When we save the event, that event is listed on the schedule screen. We now need to create a new event for when the smart plug will turn off. First, we're going to set the option, Turn My Smart Plug, to Off. Next, we need to set the timer to when the power will stop for the Christmas tree lights. Again, we need to select which days this event will take place on. Just like the previous event, we will be setting this event for every day of the week. When we select Save, this second event is added to the list on our schedule screen. Our Christmas tree lights will now turn on at 3.30pm and turn off at 11pm, 7 days a week. Let's turn off the two events in the schedule and take a look at the next option, Away. Away is a security feature. It allows you to create a time schedule that randomly supplies power to a device plugged into the smart plug. For example, if you go on holiday, you can plug the lamp into a smart plug. Using the away mode, you can set the smart plug to randomly turn the lamp on or off, giving the illusion that someone's at home. Again, away mode is set by choosing a start time, then an end time. We then need to select which days we wish the schedule to run on. Let's select every day, as in this example, we will be away on holiday for a week. When we select start, we are informed that away mode is active and we are given a summary of the settings we have chosen for away mode. If we select the stop button, away mode stops and we are returned to the configuration screen for away mode. The final scheduling option is timer. As the name suggests, this allows us to set a time for how long the smart plug should or should not supply power to a device for. We could, for example, set the timer to turn the smart plug on in 4 hours. The timer is a useful tool if you have children, as you can set exactly how long they can say watch television for before going to bed. So to recap, in this video we've taken a look at the three options of schedule, away and timer that are available on either the TP-Link HS110 or the HS100 smart plugs. 